Hello everybody, it's a pleasure to meet you all. I'm going to play Batman uh, a Batman game by Telltale Games series. Um, this is the second season. Unfortunately, I am not gonna play season one because I know the twist, twist in the stories. Um, but um, nah, it's not that surprising, alright? Anyway, I'm just gonna play this game because I really want to continue it and, the, well, you know, if somebody, if anybody likes to see how people play, then it's good, I guess, okay? So let's, let's get this started. I'm going to play first uh, episode one. Let's hear the, let's hear the... <clears throat> The thing that I want to do. That's that's what's important. Okay. I need to set some things up because in the meantime, nah, I'm not gonna. I don't plan to download that shit. Um. Oh no, momento. I want to make my. Okay, let's... Okay, okay, okay. Can this shit hear me now? Let's see. Oh my god, so many shits are open. Okay, no. okay you can hear, me, hear... You could hear everything, guys, so that... Okay. Alright, you're gonna start with the episode 1. I need to choose here which is the best for me. I just the slider to the person is barely visible. It's barely visible. For me this is barely visible. Blue tech. How do they look like so? Wait! I didn't even I just fuck's sake. That was too fast. Oh man. Whatever. I like like I like all kind of colors. Uh, of Batman, so it doesn't really matter, I guess. Yeah, I get, I got that. I know that that I will have one to make choices. One fateful night, my parents gave their lives for me. They became my. Oh, one moment, I need to. Hero. Oh fuck myself. Uh... Right, now we can continue it. Their legacy untouchable. Until I learned the truth. My father, Thomas. Uno momento, one more time. I need to check where to put myself to not intervene with this beautiful game. Because I'm not that important as the game itself. So let's be around here, I don't know. Yeah? Do you agree with me? Do you agree with your... Your... Video maker guy, I guess so. So yeah, let's Dwayne continue was a with criminal. it. He ruled over Gotham from the shadows, and everything I thought I knew about myself changed forever. The children of Arkham exposed the truth about my father to Gotham. Their attack turned friends into enemies and threw the city into chaos. I was committed to Arkham Asylum, where I escaped with the help of a mental patient named John Doe. After a bloody battle, I put an end to it all in the catacombs beneath the city. The Penguin, Two-Face, and Lady Arkham were the first real challenge I faced as the Batman. But they would not be the last. Spring has arrived in Gotham, and with it comes City Hall's quarterly crime report. Crime is way down since the fall of the children of Arkham, marking another triumph for newly minted police commissioner, James Gordon. In a statement this morning, Gordon credited his success to the public partnership between the police and the Batman. He praised the mysterious vigilante for his sacrifice 
describing him as essential to the security of the city. Things are looking up, citizens. After the long, dark winter <laughs> comes the thaw. Now, if only the Knights could win a game, everyone would be happy. I have no commands here. I'm just watching it. Lucky 13! There it is. Rumi Mori, import export magnet, one time Pipex CEO, international arms dealer. The world sees Mori as a legitimate businessman, a philanthropist who gives to charity, not a criminal getting rich off the suffering of innocence, a masterful performance. I wonder if a man hides in plain sight for that long. Does he forget who he really is? What do you think, Master Bruce? Must be hard to stay true to yourself. It's hard not to become the mask. At least a little. I can believe it. We are what we do, after all. With you, I question whether Batman is the cover or Bruce. Masks are hard to maintain. If there are cracks in Maury's, we'll find them. The GCPD already bugged his penthouse and found nothing. Meaning that if he's doing arms deals in Gotham... They happen on the casino floor. I need to find a way to hear what Maury is saying. Standing by for support. Look for something with a microphone. The bat computer can... In Al, I'm hacking into Maury's phone. Encrypting your signal. Last thing we want is for him to know you're here. We're in. You should be able to pick up audio from Maury's phone. Is everyone enjoying themselves? Don't worry. I won't tell anyone with a bad... He's on a roll. <laughs> it's only a matter of time before he gets too chatty. <laughs> Try to blend in. So, I've been sitting over there wondering... What's Bruce Wayne doing in a place like this? I figured you went to fancier casinos. Some place where only high rollers go. I'm looking for something different. New thrills. Well, it's a good thing you're here. And it's a good thing I'm here. You? What the hell are you doing here? Stop me if you've heard this one before. I begin and have no end. And I end all that begins. Who am I? I don't give a damn. I told you ten times. Our arrangement is over. Death, Mori. I am death. Something's happening, and it doesn't look like a deal. The man in the hood. Is this Riddle, man, or I remember him from your father's time. I think that's Riddler. Riddler? Is something wrong? To make a choice. You seem distracted. Bruce. You think your gibberish intimidates Hello? me? That's him. You'd better gear up. You can't just blow me off. How about we go back to my place? Oh. I'll call my driver. Meet me outside? Well, since you put it like that, I never do this, you know. You know, me neither. No one threatens me in my own casino. Security! Sir, it's time to leave. For you? An easy one. What question can you never answer yes to? I don't give a crap, let's go. <sighs> Wrong. The correct answer is are you dead? <laughs> oh my god, brother. Okay. Now, let's get started. Get out of there. Get your suit. That, that is really fast how you are that man. Like, you know, he was just a security person. But nothing to do with it. Al, let Gordon know what's happening. Right away. Hey, no one leaves. Take your ass this shit. <laughs> <laughs> Come <laughs> on. 
Yeah, that was fast. The problem for a really man like me, fucking night, you know. I mean, I mean, I'm the justice of the city. This is Commissioner this Gordon on the line, scrambling audio now. Gordon. Batman, what's the status? Multiple oh gunmen, God, hostages at the casino. Uh, fuck yes. A madman in a mask. Uh, I just remember Riddler's the first back at Gotham. Riddler? He hasn't been seen wow. in years. Well, he's putting on quite a show. He looks so much different. There's a squad on the way. Don't be there shortly. Be ready for a fight. Yeah. So emotional, the skins we have here, so emotional, I just love them, you know, the music. I don't think it's called, so I'm itching like hell, like, uh, I don't know. Please, My please, we can make the deal, anything you want. Our issues can't be solved with handshakes, Maury. This is what happens when you back out of a deal with me. There's only one way you're getting out of this alive. You have to solve a riddle. And I choose my words carefully if I were you. Listen closely. No, please, don't do this! Without fingers, I point. Without arms, I strike. Without feet, I... Wait, 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 wait. Ah, without fingers, I... What? Run. Who am I? Without I point without I've got arms. Visual. That drone, fully functional. Oh my god, these are... I don't really understand the reasons. I need a place to drop in without fun. being noticed. Time for some recon. It's a tricky one, isn't it? A mindbender that scratches at the very nature of our existence. The mere pondering of which can drive brilliant... Riddler. A terror from the past. I never thought I'd see him on our streets again. He's not to be taken lightly. And a rat in your skull. Once it's in there, uh, I don't know if I can device. solve his riddle. Doesn't there. seem like he's getting out until he guesses the riddle. This riddler certainly has an imagination. Choose your words carefully, Mori. You only have so many fingers. It'll be that Riddler's taken hostages, casino patrons, innocent bystanders. And they're clearly not his main target. Must be an insurance policy. Yeah, I just needed to figure out how this. Here is the guy that was killed uh, in the beginning. So let's go further. I mean, why does it want me? Okay, I'm kind of getting lost. Like, I don't know where to look at. Yay. So. What exactly do we have to do here? Wait, I did cut something, I don't know where. Oh, there it is. Cashier's booth. That'll do. Just need to take out the guard first. Audio playback fully functional. Time for a distraction. Pretty uh, useful equipment. Really uh, admire him. Wow. They just stay silent like that. I'm losing patience, Maury. Are you expecting a hint? Give me an answer! Batman! We can't get in. The front's covered by gunmen and they've got the back barricaded with blackjack tables. How should I deploy when we're inside? I'm relying on your eyes and ears. What's the best course of action? We need a distraction. Find a way to limit their line of sight. Sounds like a plan. 
You're completely insane! No. I don't believe that's it. No, 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 no. Ah, fuck's sake. I'll clear a path. Ah, this Wait is so sake. hard to look at. Give him hell. We're counting on you. What kind of beginning is this? Like, you know, just... Grapple, smoking sign, rope stand. Rope stand. Shit, you. I'm pressing it. Tear off, slam into. Roulette wheel. I, I'm choosing the roulette wheel. Oh my god, it looks so good. You're ahead of schedule. I'm a little busy right now, but I'll see if I can fit you in. Not him, the hostage! Shoot the hostage! Oh, fuck. The gun, the hostage. I'm choosing the gun. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. What's going on? Oh, I see. There are new me mechanics here. Wow. Smash him, bro. Hiya, bats. The Batman clearly isn't using his head. Break it open. With pleasure. Not the archer for me, let's see this stuff. Tie him down, shock him, I will shock him. Ooh! Oh my god, this, this is... Oh, oh, oh! I've heard stories in the streets about you, Batman. You're the biggest name in Gotham since... Well... Since I left town. Oh, oh. Everyone's very impressed with you. Ah, fuck my life. Impressed. Gotham's criminals have become zealots and thugs in cheap suits. And you, I've come home to find a wannabe in my chair. Eating my goddamn porridge. This is my city. Now I'm back. And I'm taking what's mine. You don't know me, Riddler. Oh, you have no idea what you're up against. You must think you're so special. You're not the first hero. I've put down. You're supposedly the world's greatest detective. Yet here you are. Gordon, go! Completely at <laughs> oh, you have to be kidding. Clever. But not smart enough. Done. Back in the day. Back in the day, what is he talking about? Wow. This guy knows how to fight. That's for sure. Oh, just uh just uh hook uh like a common street hurt. Just doesn't do it for me. Wow, that's really a good stick. Can roll everything up. Oh, that guy. That guy is still safe. Follow the power lines. There must be a weak point. What? 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 Uh. What? What is going? No. Whoa, 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 whoa! What's happening here? I don't even know what I'm doing. Following the power lines, let me. Brawling like a common street hunt. It just doesn't do it for me. Does this trick show? Of course. Okay, so I can save him, I just need to follow the power lines. There must be a weak point. Oh, okay. There's nothing hard 
बाद That's cheating. Think I care about your rules? I'd heard you're a man who followed a code. Why would you save that dirtbag's life? Mori made his money running guns, trading off the suffering of war. Why wouldn't you just let him die? I believe in justice. Mori deserves a trial in a court of law. If he's guilty, his cell will be right next to yours. Oh yeah. Justice. That's Ridiculous. Like Either way, you won't be the one to put me there. You know, Batman has to uh, be the guy because he doesn't kill anybody. You know, he just brings the people in the in the police station. Maybe he beats up the guys, but you know, the, uh, this is the necessary thing. What he has to do. What he's doing. Body slam run toes. Ah, I'm loving the run toes kick. Run toes is such a good kick. Enough and of this! What? What? I you just know don't how understand how can he blow up everything that. like that. But it's not enough. Let's see how you do with something a little more cerebral. Better hurry, detective. Solve my puzzle soon. Or people are gonna get hurt. And we know you can't let that happen. Just blows everything up into one button. You know, just like this. Button, 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 like this. Button, button. Button. What? Eh, cool, 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 cool. What the fuck is this? Okay, I'm now Spider-Man. What the? Wow. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. You should have called us before going in, Gordon. Hey, hey, lady. Waller. After all, we're here to help. Wow, he's he's really really cool as well. Okay. This is the beginning of the first episode of season two. My bad, season two. Season two, guys. Season two. I think it was a good, is a good beginning of the new villain, or, or of presenting the new villain, Riddle Riddler. He, he did fine. So we have this Riddle, which I think will be a fucking big boom. Scan, take, scan it. Let's scan it Circuitry first. Circuitry inside, but nothing obviously dangerous. The back computer will be able to analyze further. Wow, oh, everything looks so good. I'm just in love with the skin. Also, your days Batman are numbered. Like that muscular. Freak. We'll see each other again. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Keep one eye in the sky, jerk-offs. Heavens are gonna fall on your goddamn heads. Tell me all about it, down at the precinct. The Riddler's right hand in custody? Not a bad result, all told. Riddler used to leave clues at all his crime scenes. Always thought he was smarter than the people trying to catch him. Thought we could use help dragging him down. He got a sick pleasure out of taunting us. He was smart enough to slip through our fingers. Yeah, and leave a bloody mess in his wake. Riddler's heyday was a dark time in Gotham. And what we just saw, he hasn't mellowed with age. Uh-huh, get Fernandez on it right away. Commissioner Gordon! Brace yourself. Just so you know, this woman has a lot of juice with the governor. Rub her the wrong way, I could end up on foot patrol till I retire. My people are Fuck my life. This shit needs to be trained for
For situations like this, Gordon, we'd have Riddler in custody if you'd only picked up the phone. So, you're the legendary Batman. I've heard a great deal about you. So much so, I don't know if I should believe the hype. And you are. This is Amanda Waller, director of the agency. What are the feds doing here? Riddler's their case. The GCPD has been asked to open our doors to them. Give them whatever they need. We've been tracking that maniac for some time. No one knows more about him than we do. World-class criminals like Riddler, they're kind of our specialty. Does this one speak? Just say what you want to say. With pleasure. Riddler used to be a player in Gotham back when Thomas Wayne and Falcone ran the city. He disappeared so suddenly, and for so long, everyone thought he was dead. <laughs> everyone was wrong. Riddler's back, and if these theatrics are anything to go by, he wants the whole city to know. My people tell me you did some good work handling him, Batman. You and me? I bet we'd make a damn fine team. I heard how you dealt with Lady Arkham. Not to mention the city's corrupt mayor, Dent. We could do great things together if we joined forces. I work with Gordon. No one else. I appreciate loyalty. But that there... That's the issue. The only real problem with your setup is who you're working with. Local law enforcement clearly can't cut I got a local crime rate says otherwise. <laughs> Ms. Waller... Please, Commissioner. Tear gas. In a hostage situation, we got an ambulance full of civilians with their eyes swollen shut. Not to mention you let Riddler slip through your fingers. You GCPD cowboys clearly don't know what you're doing. You're putting all this on me? You're the commanding officer, aren't you? You can't put this on Jim. I called for a distraction. Then maybe you're not as impressive as I thought. I'm here to prevent this incompetence in the future. I gotta get a security detail on Mori while he's in the hospital. Agent Avesta will fill you in on what we know so far, as a token of interdepartmental cooperation. The nerve on her. Don't tell these people a thing, especially about that puzzle. This is our town. We're the ones that'll catch Riddler. Oof. I thought she was gonna bite your head off for a second. Uh, I'd like to see her try. Special Agent in Monta Vesta, Field Intelligence Specialist on the Riddler case. And my partner, Agent Blake. How do you do? I put together this psychological profile of Riddler. You'll see when you read it, he's... changed. For your eyes only, <laughs> if you catch my drift. The target of the casino attack, Rumi Mori. Any idea what Riddler wanted with him? We figure it has something to do with why he's back in Gotham. I heard them talking about some kind of deal. Any idea what? No. But it'd be safe to say they didn't come to terms. Thanks. That's a help. <clears throat> I'm Gotham born and raised, you know. My dad ran a store in the shadow of City Stadium. I just wanted to say it's a real honor to meet you. I do have something I want to ask, though. The criminally insane, you're drawn to them, aren't you? There's something in you that pulls you towards the danger, the chaos, the energy. I don't like what you're insinuating. Uh, of course, I... Keep your pop's psych evaluations to Riddler and stay out of my head. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to pry. I think I know you a little better now. I'll be in touch. Agent. Batman, before you go, Gotham's your sit.
I respect that, but you should know I don't have to play nice. I'm letting you hunt the Riddler for now. You better share everything you find, or this courtesy call is gonna become something you really won't like. You get me? There's a lot of ways this could go. An eventful evening. I have taken the liberty of preparing some refreshments. Uh, thanks, Al. I need to focus. Maybe music will help. Can't go wrong with the classics. The computer is finished scanning the Riddler's puzzle box. It's ready when you are. Let's get to work. No explosives detected, no radioactivity. Nothing dangerous at all so far. Computer, run. Another scan. I want to be absolutely sure this thing is safe. Also, I took the liberty of digging up everything I could find on the agency. There's plenty here. Know your enemy and all that. It... it comes and goes. Never... since the kidnapping and, and all the other business with Lady Arkham. Alfred. <clears throat> Nana! Don't you worry about me. I, I, I should be fine. It was worse after my first tour of duty. Your family, Alfred. We worry about family. Thank you, Bruce. It'll pass. Working always helps.
The agency, the public face of a shadow committee of military leaders, intelligence experts, and government officials. Civil rights violations, domestic black sites, decentralized accountability. This information, it's all before Waller took over the director position. Perhaps she's given them a new direction. Maybe, but the agency's empowered to override local law enforcement with impunity. That man's got some competition in town. I wonder if we need be worried about losing our unpaid and thoroughly exhausting job, I mean. Well, things won't be easy with a bunch of spies nearby. They're well-equipped spies, too. Maybe it wouldn't hurt to talk to Lucius about upgrades. Try and level the playing field. Riddler terrorized this city long before you were Batman. Gotham's original costumed criminal. Yes, to have him returned, it's unsettling. I remember when he was the scourge of the underworld. 
Even Carmine Falcone gave him a wide berth. He was presumed dead for so long. Why come back to Gotham? Well, he seemed to have a prior relationship with Mori. Some kind of axe to grind. Let me upload the rest of this to the Codex. The agency realized Riddler was still alive when he orchestrated a prison break at Peña Duro. My men here say you let yourself get caught, Mr. Riddler. Just Riddler. Why willingly turn yourself in? Oh, Mr. Warden. To get everyone else out, of course. That wasn't obvious. The man's deranged. If you ask me, he needs help. He's clearly sick. The man is in urgent need of a doctor. I know just the place for him. Plenty of room at Arkham Asylum. Next to him, most of the inmates seem like a picture of health. What was that? You should see your face. Its confusion is delightful. I think I'll take it with me. Oh, my God! I take everything back. Let's see what Riddler's little gift is all about. Solve my puzzle soon, or people will get hurt. Uh, Riddler's M.O. hasn't changed in all these years. There's writing engraved along the rim. I have an eye, yet cannot see. Who am I? That sounds familiar. I've heard it before. Don't happen to remember the answer, do you? Sadly, no. The eye of a needle. But how does that relate to the object in question? Maybe it's telling us how to use it. Uh, sounds very plausible. Look at these strange grooves. Never forget. Suit has held up remarkably well so far. <laughs> In spite of everything you put it through.
No one beats Lucius's handiwork. Guess is as good as mine. Harvey Dent. He was a friend. Once. In the end, Harvey can make a single decision without consulting his lucky coin. He's in Arkham Asylum now with the rest of the criminally insane. Vicky Vale, a.k.a. Lady Arkham. Driven to madness, leader of the children of Arkham. Record needle. Halfway there, Batman. Means you've got half a chance of stopping a whole lot of pain. To be honest, you're already doing better than I thought. But don't sit around feeling pleased with yourself. Unless you want to see me tear this city apart. I suppose you're going to look in there. An open invitation from the Riddler? Of course. Huh. Looks like I'm manipulating radio bands or waveforms. Something. 
I'm not sure what I'm looking at or how any of it is actually displaying. Uh, not sound. What? Oh, uh... I'm not really sure about any of it. Get Lucius on the line, will you? Hey, Alfred. Good morning, Lucius. I hope we're not interrupting your breakfast. My youngest is probably stealing all the bacon, but duty calls. What's up? This is a puzzle from the Riddler. There's a strange waveform pattern I can manipulate inside that needs your expertise. I, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, I can meet you at Wayne Tower in a little bit. We'll uh, fire up the R&D lab. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. No, no, don't worry about it. It's actually going to be a big day for me. Tiffany starts at Wayne Enterprises. Tiffany? Really? Your daughter working alongside you. How wonderful. Uh, certainly is. Bruce, I'll see you soon. Bye, Lucius. Can't wait to see Tiffany. I'll be at Wayne Town. Yay, I fucked up. Wait, is the voice? Yay. Yay. Did it? Yay, okay, it's here. Alright. Uh, yay, it didn't uh, record. My microphone sound that well. Okay, I apologize for that. Fuck that shit. You know, we make mistakes. Fuck that shit. Fuck everything here. Fuck that shit. Ugh, fuck. Good hunting, Bruce. Never mind that if my if I was talking. Never mind. I I was just reading out like out loud things. It doesn't really matter that much. Let's just continue the game. Like never, no, nothing happened. You know, like fuck myself. Oh, excellent. Glad I caught you. I have some good news to share. Good to hear it, Regina. It's what I've come to expect, with you as Wayne Enterprises chairperson. I just talked to the board and they couldn't be more pleased with how our partnership with the GCPD is going. Seems like you made the right call when you decided to take that contract over the Arkham remodel. The Gazette's running a piece about it. Look, I would love to hear all the details, but I've got a meeting with Lucius I've got to run to. Well, I don't mean to pry, but... What's in that case? Seems like an odd thing to be carrying around the office. Oh, just some tax papers. Accounting is doing an audit or something. Well, you shouldn't have to be burdened with that. I can take them. It's okay. I got it. Well, I've got a meeting I've got to run to. We'll pick up this conversation this afternoon. That sounds great. I don't think she's suspicious at all. I needed to lie, you know, just just a little lie. No. Okay, here's Lucius. You're in my chair. Just updating the encryption on your bat tech. But if you want me to stop? Oh, no, the seat is all yours. This is the thing you were talking about? One of Riddler's puzzles. Some kind of test. Show me. Huh. Any idea what he's planning? Not yet. That's why I need your help. If his history is anything to go by, he left us a clue. A psychological profile of Riddler. Uh, knowing how his mind works, this should come in handy. No sign of explosives or poison. Already scanned for that in the cave. Look at that. Micro pulse waveform. Ah, and the sound it's giving off. A signal, maybe? <laughs> I couldn't decipher it. I was hoping you could help with that. I'll see what I can do. Shouldn't take long. What in the 
It's not one of mine. Think fast. Hi, Dad. <laughs> Tiffany? Hey, Bruce. T my God, Tiffany. It's been a while. Sneaking out of orientation your first day? I just wanted to say hi to my new boss. I got you a present. A micro drone prototype I developed in my spare time. High-end AV, stealth black shell, programmable for autonomous observation. Small, quiet, and super smart. Just like its designer. Not bad, huh? You always had a thing for toys. It's so hard to know what to get a man who has everything. So I made you some tech the government would be jealous of. I love it. Thanks, Tiffany. Well, I guess it's not bad. Not bad. See what I had to deal with growing up? Huh. There's something different about you. Uh, there is? And I don't just mean what happened to your ear. Yeah, I'm all, I, I was also looking at this. On it. But you look... You look... You look... I think the uh, the word you're looking for is... Badass. Um, no. That is definitely not what I meant. I'm the resident badass around here. Thank you very much. Huh? <laughs> you just said that out loud. Uh, see, Bruce? It's her first day, and I'm already embarrassing her. Interesting. Don't. Too late. Already touching. Just be careful. What a strange thing. The circuitry design. It's elaborate and unorthodox. Almost intentionally so. Like whoever put it together was kind of showing off. Huh. Micro pulse waves? It's just weird. Seriously, what is this thing? I've never seen anything like it. It's like whoever made it. Well, something your dad has been working on. Lucius, care to explain? Oh, it's nothing. Just an old piece of tech that found its way into my lab. But what does it do? That's what we're trying to work out. You guys are lucky I'm here to help. Uh, help with... Figure this freakish thing out. Uh, Tiffany did graduate first in her class at Cornell in molecular engineering. Let me take a crack at it. I can help you get to the bottom of this. Figure out what it does. All right, if you think you can help, then be my guest. Oh, I know I can help. I just gotta let him know that I won't be finishing up orientation. Uh, no problem. Oh, I was planning on swinging by the manor after work to see Alfred. I heard he wasn't doing so well. That he was having some issues with his health? Oh, well, I'll, well, I'll let him tell you himself, but, uh... He hasn't been doing so great since the kidnapping last year. Oh, no. One year. Yeah, as I said, is, uh, one year has passed Best since the last season. I'd like him to see a therapist, but you know Alfred. Well, maybe I can convince Alfred is him. such a nice guy, please. Everybody loves him. He sacrifices himself to, to the ones he's loyal to. Catch you guys later. Welcome aboard, Tiffany. Thanks, boss. You know, I just kind of, uh, kind of afraid to. All right then. I'm kind of afraid to be friendly with everybody, you know, because I'm Batman, and if if they get too close to me, they I'm the they maybe figure it out that who I am. Who is my second? I never told her, you know. Told her what I really do at Wayne Enterprises, what uh, we do. If you're willing to pull her into this Riddler project. Why not consider bringing her into the fold? Into the mission? We're going to need help. If we're gonna be dealing with the likes of Riddler. And we can trust her. She's family after all. We well, don't have to talk about this right now. We have enough on our plates at the moment. Well, shall we go down to the lab? Actually, the I think it's too dangerous. Need is down in my office. I don't want to we'll get this taken care of in no time. That much. Mr. Wayne. Uh, yes? I'm Special Agent Avesta. This is my partner, Special Agent Blake. Uh, well, I 
Guess I'll see you in a bit. I'll be down at my office. Whenever you uh, get done here. I'll be down in a few. No worries. I'll uh, start without you. Sorry for the unannounced visit. We're with the agency's behavioral analysis unit. We just came by to ask a few questions. Please, come in. Make yourselves at home. Uh, can I get my assistant to get you anything? Uh, coffee, water, donuts? Don't worry. This won't take long. This office, it really represents you. Well, I like to think so. Is this you? Yeah. How old? I don't know, seven, eight, maybe. <laughs> so happy. After everything you've been through, I don't know how you still do it. Do what, exactly? It wasn't long ago when you were the most hated man in Gotham, yet you still give so much back to the city. Why do you continue to help Gotham? Most people wouldn't be so charitable after that. What's that all about? Fuck, I, I'm just thinking too much and... It's okay. You don't have to talk about it. It's not what saying time? anything. What Fuck. is it you want? The agency recently got in anything. to draft a psychological portrait of the Riddler. We've been tracking him for months, but haven't been able to find him. Anything I can help with? See, I told you he'd be cooperative. Agent Blake thought you'd be cagey, defensive, based on your history. Guess he was wrong. My, uh, my history? A lot of things happened to you last year, and not all of them were good. You helped the GCPD capture Oswald Cobblepot, better known as the Penguin. He was a terrorist, a member of the Children of Arkham, and your friend. Come to think of it, you've been associated with quite a few psychopaths over the years. I wouldn't go that far. I would. The criminally insane, they seem drawn to you. Either that, or you're often in the wrong place at the wrong time. Yes, having money and fame makes you an easy target. I've had my fair share of crazies knocking on my door. Like this guy. I think you'd know him as John Doe. We understand that it was during your stay in Arkham where you and John met and became friends. From the sound of it, you two were close. John may very well say that, yes. But not you. A conversation in a mental hospital does not make us friends, much less close. I see. According to hospital records, you and John were involved in a riot. They captured the whole incident on video. I saw you flee after John cut another inmate, a man named Victor Zaz. Several people were hurt. I wasn't myself at the time, okay? I, I was... Drugged by Lady Arkham. I know the story. John was discharged from Arkham months ago. No one has seen or heard from him since. I was thinking maybe you have. <laughs> Why would you think that? He listed you as his emergency contact. Oh, sounds like you two were pretty close to me. Sounds like something a crazy person would do. Maybe you made an impression on him. Well, I haven't seen or heard from him, so... Did he do something wrong? He's a person of interest. You see, we've got a wall in the office with a bunch of photos pinned to it. Two-Face, Penguin, Lady Arkham, you know, Gotham's most notorious. They've got all these little strings connecting them to one another, like a web. And you, my friend, are at the center. You keep pretty strange company for someone who wants everyone to think they're such a stand-up guy. <laughs> and your point is what exactly? That... I'm some kind of criminal mastermind. Or just really unlucky. You know more than you're letting on, Mr. Wayne. Maybe you're afraid. Maybe you don't trust us. Or 
Maybe you're a criminal, like your father. Maybe you're not the hero people think you are. Get the hell out of my... That's an evacuation warning. It's time for you to leave. We'll pick this up another time. Let's speak out the phone. Get my daughter out of the building. Get yourself out. What are you talking? What did you figure out? I've I've solved the Riddler's puzzle, Bruce. Uh, Riddler really pulled a good one over on us. You just hold tight, Lucius. I'm coming down to help. It's too late for that. Tell Tiffany that I love her. That I'm sorry I wasn't around. Whoa, wait, 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 no. We really made a difference, didn't we, Batman? What? No. 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 If uh, I just didn't pick it up at the phone, I should have. Fuck. One Fuck. And fourteen injured after a tragic explosion. The GCPD is opening an investigation into what they are calling an industrial accident. Wayne Enterprises Chief Technology Officer Lucius Fox. No, Fox sake. Last, a small service is being held for the tech giant and father of three at Divinity Church this Sunday. No, 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 no. Wait, I need to look at uh, if there is a way to save him. Fuck's sake. Is there a way to save Lucius? Lucius? Lucius! Lucius. Okay, so uh, yeah, I looked at the, at the internet. I cannot save him. What what a nice game, you know they say you know they say oh, you have to make choices. Well, to tell you the truth, in the end, you you are, are just a few choices, and it it's not gonna affect that much. It's not gonna affect the future that much. You know, Dreamfell chapters, I have played it uh, a few months ago and it had a lot of choices and it affected a lot. Uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, Telltale Games is a good game, but still it's just like, you know, you don't have much choices. You can say, you can choose what you say, you can look at things, you, you are controlling a little bit, but not that much. So. That's what I have to say. This is a fucked up game at some point. You don't have to worry, Lucius. Tiffany. I'm gonna take care of your family. As if they were my own. Just like Lucius took care of you. Lucius helped raise you, Bruce. It was family. Riddler's attack on the casino was one thing. But this... This is personal. Look at his face. We can't let him get away with it. He's angry Riddler's as well. struck at the heart of our operations. And tore a family apart in the process. Don't worry, Al. I will find him. And bring him to justice. He will spend the rest of his life behind bars. I'm glad to see your sense of duty still reigns supreme. Of course, it won't bring poor Lucius back. I can't imagine how devastated she must be to lose her father in such a violent way. <laughs> this is, go this is fucked up. Yes. You know, at least, at least this is not the true story of Batman, so I don't have to, you know, be 
as devastated as these people because this isn't the true line of Batman, no. She but mostly the, the good guys get. survive. It's just to make some tragedy. And still, it's it's <sighs> fucked. It, it is fucked up. I still can't believe he's gone. None of this. None of this feels real. Your dad was like family to me. If if there's anything I can do, anything at all, please let me know. <sighs> Thanks, Bruce. I appreciate it. He loved working for you, you know? They hardly saw him at home because of it. Mom used to complain my little brother was growing up without a dad. Now I guess it's true. He was so busy. I can't remember the last time I got to hang out with him. Okay. I'm Just responsible for... For because she didn't have Just a father in her time. childhood. There were so many things I wanted to talk to him about. I asked a lot of him. Maybe too much. And he gave it all, didn't he? A real company man. Well, I hope it was worth it. Oh, she hates me. Fuck. She hates me as fuck. <sighs> Tiffany. I'm sorry. I know I shouldn't blame you. <laughs> hey, 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 it's okay. It's okay. Just let it out. I'm just trying to wrap my head around it all. I saw his remains, Bruce. There, there was hardly anything left. What were you guys working on that could have caused that? It, it doesn't quite add up. Please tell me. For my own sanity. Tiffany, I will tell you soon. Just not here. What do you mean? Why not? It's not the right time. Hot, Bruce. What are you mixed up in? Fine. Just tell me one thing. That weird disc. Was that what killed him? Did you put my father's life at risk for that? I'm begging you. Just tell me that one thing. I need to know. I'm not gonna tell her. How can you even ask me that? You have to believe me. I would never put Lucius in harm's way. Oh, God, I'm so sorry. It's just, I'm so angry. I just don't know who to blame. I'm not gonna tell her that I, no, no. I miss him so much. I'm gonna be the liar here. Let's just hug her and be the good guy. The service is starting. You should go be with your family. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Bruce. Thank you, Bruce. Thank you, Bruce. So we are it. You know? <sighs> so sorry, really. It's such a shame. At least he went out with a bang, oh. right? <laughs> For that, we can all nah, be something grateful. interesting. You, you knew my father. Well, no, but just. Whoa, whoa! What the heck? Bruce, what's going on? You know this guy? I'm so sorry. I will handle this. Jeez, Bruce, that's quite a grip. Gonna leave a bruise for sure. What are you doing here? I told you I'd see you again. Didn't I? You and me, 
We're two threads in the same stitch. Look, I, I, I got you a little something just, just to mark the occasion. I knew you'd be hurting, see? I thought it might make you feel better. You think this is funny? My friend is dead. Oh, I got it wrong, didn't I? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Gotta be quiet as church mice, right? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so is said as fuck. It hasn't, um... It hasn't been easy for me out here, you know? I'm the new guy now. It's the freedom that gets to you. There's so damn much you hardly know what to do with it. <laughs> it's not like Arkham. Sometimes I miss those padded walls. You knew where the lines were drawn. Which one's not to cross? <laughs> you can't possibly mean that, Ed. Arkham is hell. It was my home, Bruce. And home is where the heart is. I'm almost sorry that I convinced Dr. Leland to release me. If everyone could please take their seats, uh, we will begin. Would you? Just sit down. Today we gather to honor the memory of Lucius Fox. He was a friend, a father, a husband, a leader. You are crashing my friend's funeral, John. You better have a good reason. Oh, I do. I need that uh, favor you owe me. You know, you, you might have been a little reluctant at the time, but if it wasn't for me, You'd still be in Arkham, sleeping off your meds in the rec room with Zaz. You're, you're gonna do right by me, aren't you? I know you're a man of your word. I didn't agree to that. But you did help me out. Friends look out for each other, am I right? And now, he's gone. A vital link in our chain. You see, I met some inspiring people out here, made some new friends, made a kind of pact. They're amazing, Bruce, that special breed who live by their own rules. They remind me of you, of your father. So who are they? You'll find out when you meet them. They're looking to bring someone like you into the fold. You, you will meet them for me, won't you? Please? I've, I've got a lot riding on this. I already told them you would. Please don't let me down. Not a chance, John. I don't know what you're mixed up in, but I am not getting involved. Ooh, disappointing. <laughs> You know, I spoke so highly of you. I told them you'd fit right in. It just makes me want to, I don't know, lash out. Shh. 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 We're here to mourn. Please, you trust me again. You'll be mourning the loss of your teeth. How dare you? Oh, easy, easy, John. Take a deep breath, okay? Calm down. You're right. Hmm. Sorry, Bruce, that outburst, it, it's antisocial, I know. Dr. Leland says I have a hard time handling rejection. I think it's the stress. You see, I've got this enemy. Real piece of work. Calls himself the Riddler. How do you know the Riddler? Know him? I want to rip his eyeballs out. 
He's a thief and a killer, and worst of all, he's... He's rude. He's rude. <laughs> what the fuck? I tried to let the authorities know the kind of lowlife they're dealing with, but... Uh, we are getting to the interesting part, Wait finally. A minute. You know him, too. Of course, a man of Bruce Wayne's caliber knows everyone. So I shouldn't be surprised. Not your usual crowd, though. Or so I thought. Uh, just from the news, I mean, the guy's clearly a murderer, sick in the head. Don't know the half of it. If I had my way, that smarmy know-it-all would never leave his hole. In his hole? You know where he is. No, no, not exactly, no. Maybe I said too much. I'm your friend, John. You can trust me. Uh, trust is the mainstay of any healthy relationship. I want that for us, Bruce. I really do. Yeah, I, I really don't know much. I heard the egomaniac always made people go to him for meetings. Somewhere in the East End. Where in the East End? Honestly, that's all I know. And even that might be out of date. If you're so eager to find him, why don't you let me help you? I'll find out where he is and get back to you. See if I can't find out where that jerk puts his head down. It'd be just like the old days. Do not get involved. When this clearly means so much to you. No, no. Don't you worry about a thing. I'll take care of this. Just meet my friends later. Like I asked. Look, I think I outstayed my welcome here. I'm, I'm just gonna slip away. This guy, oh Excuse my god. Me. Sorry. Huh. It's, uh, it's been so nice catching up, Bruce. I miss this. This trust between us. I know we'll see each other again soon. Be in touch. Goodbye, Bruce. Until next time. Intriguing fellow. Certainly not one for decorum. I don't think that outburst went unnoticed. Oh, whatever you say about John, he gave me a lead on Riddler's location. Inform Gordon. Tell him to drag up GCPD records on Gotham's East End. And tell him we're on Riddler's trail. do these days. There's one thing for the bad parts of town to get ugly. But when places Smoking like is gonna kill you, Gordon. Falling apart. Makes you wonder what's next. Ah, I bet Bruce Wayne is wondering the same thing. Seems like the world's got it out for that guy. Spends some time in Arkham, gets drugged through the dirt by the media for something he didn't do. Finally picks himself up. And what happens? Someone bombs his company. Wayne has a talent for finding himself in the crosshairs. Uh, you can say that again. You said you had a lead on Riddler. Hiding somewhere in the East End. Why am I not surprised? East End's been a no man's land since Harvey Dent blew it up. I've tried to get more patrols out there, but City Hall's not giving up the funds. The area between 42nd and 48th, more or less lawless. That narrows down the search at least. <laughs> A construction site at the center of 46th. Abandoned. Harvey's boys demolished that area, chasing the children of Arkham. There's nothing but a crater there. Not really a place for Riddler to oh, have a Oh, part of the city, that's a building, a part of the city that Ari then blew up. Looks yeah. like gang activity is heating up along 43rd. Oh, I'll see what I can do. He's such a monster to do that. Hey, I get it, but we're stretched thin, I told you. Eh, Riddler's a loner. I bet he's avoiding that area. 
The land at the end of 44th was recently purchased anonymously. Well, the only thing there is an old water tower. Hmm. Something feels fishy about that. My gut tells me that's the place. Agreed. Uh, nice work, Batman. Hey, if this leak pans out, Waller will have to eat her words. <laughs> Whatever you said to her at the casino really got up her nose. I have to tell you, I got a bad feeling about her. How so? It's the way she goes after criminals. She's ruthless. Puts her people at risk. And believe me, she doesn't let due process get in her way. So stop at nothing, and I mean nothing, to get her man. That doesn't sit right with me. And I don't think she's good for Gotham. As far as law enforcement goes, Jim, you are the best of it. I don't know many cops with as much heart as you. Uh, I appreciate you saying that. Waller, she doesn't see that as a strength. I was ordered to give her updates on breaks in the Riddler case. Uh, if there's a chance he's there, we should probably let her know. Don't want to give her ammunition with the governor. She's already got him breathing down my neck about what went down at the casino. Notify Waller. She's proven useful so far. Just be careful around her, huh? She moved her people into my downtown precinct without so much as a please or thank you. I tell you, Batman, she keeps on chipping away at my authority. I'm gonna crack. Then let's find Riddler before it comes to that. I'll have my people call her people on the way. Riddler won't feel so clever after we come not. I told Waller about our lead on this place. She's caught up in briefings, can't get here for a while. She said she appreciates the cooperation. Not exactly cozy, is it? Let's see what we can learn. Okay, some more boring investigations. Someone's keeping a scrapbook. Vane, isn't he? See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. Damn it. Nothing interesting. It's, it's stuck. I Only hope Gordon is not gonna get inside. killed. Then how do we get out? We go in. After you. crack house any day. No speak, no hear. What is it? No no smell or whatever. Oh god. Special Agent Mario Fernandez. Holy crap. He's one of Waller's. One of his pupils is fully dilated, the other's contracted. A clear sign of brain trauma. Huh. There's no sign of a blow to the head. The man bit his tongue clean through. He must have suffered a shock, or a sudden jolt. There's some hemorrhaging from the ears. His eardrums must have burst. One shoe is missing. The sole of the other one's almost completely melted through. 
He's missing parts of his fingers on the right hand. We saw this before. The victim in the casino. Yeah, he probably had to solve riddle and got his uh, fingers chopped down and he... He... You know, he... He injured... He... No. He was too shocked, you know, to suffer all those injuries. Uh, get uh, four of his fingers cut down and he couldn't uh, endure the pain so he died in the trauma he was trying to call for help the phone isn't getting a signal damn it me either that's a hell of an invitation Riddler's playing games. Bet he tried to play alone. We can learn from his mistakes. Let's find out what he did wrong. One shoe, melted. Must belong to poor Cinderella over there. Cinderella? Oh, that's rude. Masks. Each one missing a different facial feature. The senses. They're missing their senses. Like the monkey statues. You're right. There must be a connection. There are bleeds inside. And a lot of blood. We know Riddler likes penalizing his victims for wrong answers. Safes with electronic locks. <sighs> Shut tight. These must be the goal of whatever game we're playing. Come on, monkeys. More monkey statues. I'm starting to sense a theme here. No see, no hear, no... No see, no hear, no speak. That's an agency issue pistol. Packs a hell of a jolt. I saw it take down Riddler's goons at the casino. It was impressive. Gotta give it to Waller, her people have great tech. Take a look at this. Huh. Well, that's the same kind of body cam the GCPD issues its officers. Maybe there's a clue on the recording. Can't hurt to look. Because you've been so candid with me, I'm giving you a chance your other comrades won't get. A chance at getting out of this alive. We'll catch you. The agency, they'll find. I shouldn't have to remind you that you've been chasing me for years. And I've always been two steps ahead. If you win the game, I'll let you go free. And you'll get a consolation prize. An exclusive sneak peek into how I'm going to kill all of your colleagues. <laughs> now, how is that for motivation? Screw you! Oh. He had the agent bound while he beat him. Let's... Where did you... What links do we have here? Open safe. Look at... Let's look at the death chamber. Another one of Riddler's sick contraptions. Some kind of murder box, I guess. Well, he was always a wacko, but this takes it to a new level. Okay, semi. It's still warm. There must be some kind of heating element underneath. 
This thing is built like an oven. You could be cooked alive in there. Turn me round, but not the right way, and you might live to see another day. What does it mean? Won't budge. Must be locked in place. The glass. It's polarized. So it is. The floor of the box heated up while the agent was inside. He tried standing on one foot to save the other, causing that shoe to catch on fire. When he exited the box, he tried to put the fire out, but couldn't. So he threw off his shoe. Okay, it's part of the story. Let's examine this shit as well. We have a lot to examine here. Scratches on the monitor. The polarizing filter has been tampered with. Like in sunglasses. Monitors typically have a polarizing filter to reduce reflection. I don't see anything. Impossible to see with the naked eye. We're going to have to look at it through a polarized lens. right at those monitors. Since the monitors have been tampered with, it's likely there's a message on it. One that can only be seen with a polarized lens. You won't know until you're inside the box, though. Hey, I got a hunch. Come here. No matter how careful Riddler is, chances are good he hasn't scrubbed his own computer. Good call. It's worth checking out. Oh, mobile and email. I'm gonna look at the emails. All right. Worry. He sold technology to Riddler. I talk about strange bedfellows. You know, Waller's been keeping pretty tight tabs on Mari for a while now. She must have known. Alright, I will take the deal just so long as you stay away from my family. You can pick up the product at the usual place. I will remind you that I've complied with all of your breakfast up to this point. After this transaction, we are done. Okay. Let's look at the co-worker. What does it say? Riddler's not working alone. Just wonderful. More psychos to worry about. He and his colleagues. They don't see eye to eye. Apparently maybe they don't Joker. like his beef with me. Hey, maybe we'll get lucky they'll kill each other. For someone so smart, you sometimes act really stupid. Those resources are not for your crackpot feud with Batman. You know that... You know that and you went ahead anyway. All you gain with your games is attention, which we really don't want right now. Stick to the plan, or we'll have to make changes. I, yeah, this is clearly not a bad uh, Joker. I recognize some of the names. Joker li list. likes uh, attention as well. They're all Waller's people. Names, addresses, phone numbers. We have to warn her. First, we have to get out of here. must have been looking for the answer in one of these safes. He chose the wrong one. Cost him his fingers. You got a VR in that cowl or something? Something like that. I've got all the pieces of Riddler's puzzle. Now I need to know what order they happened in.
hope that doesn't make sense. The agent woke up here where his body cam fell off. Once he found he couldn't call for help, he saw the message on the monitors and willingly put himself inside the murder box. The agent's shoe caught fire inside the murder box, so he opened it in a panic. As soon as he was out of the box, he ripped off the burning shoe and threw it. Somewhere in the confusion, he must have missed something crucial. From where he lost his shoe, the agent beelined for the wall of safes. He opened one, but chose poorly. The blade sliced off his fingers. And there he met his end. Though it's still unclear how and when his eardrums could have burst. The agent made a number of mistakes. Mistakes we can avoid. The heat inside the box forced him to run out before he could... Before he could get Riddler's next clue. Poor bastard couldn't withstand the heat. The Batsuit's armor is heat resistant. It'll buy me more time to find Riddler's next clue. Getting inside the box and starting the game is the only way we're getting out of here. This is insane. You know that, right? No, see? The last man who went in there is dead. There's a good chance it'll kill you, too. Don't worry, Jim. I'm not going to lose this game. I'm not so sure. No, see? But if no, you say it, here, you usually no speak. do it. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. But which one is he referring to? Whichever one it is, the correct safe will have a face with those senses removed. Yeah, I'll check. Ah, damn it. It's still locked shut. They should unlock when I open this door. One, one. Okay, I guess I should have opened it instead. I just me more time to find Riddler's next I just clue. wanted to know the getting inside the box and starting the game is the only way we're getting out of here. You know, I just need this down. is insane. You know that, right? The last man who went in there is dead. Maybe you'd like to go in and solve all for yourself. No, go ahead. I wouldn't want to steal your thunder. Let's just do it again, real fast. Monkeys. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. But which one is he referring to? Whichever one it is, the correct safe will have a face with those senses removed. Yeah, I'll check. Ah, oh, damn it. It's still locked shut. They should unlock when I open this door. Withstand my short range ultrasonic device. Let's test it out, shall we? That's killing my eardrums as well. You should open the safe. I'll put a stop to this damn noise. 
Ask the third. That's uh, no speak, right? Oh my god! Are oh, you fucking kidding me there? They're starting. Oh, speak. Speak my well. E. Not that one. You know you will. Fuck that! Just open everything. Oh yeah, I'm dead! Yay! Uh, let's try again. Sky of it kills my eardrums as well. What the hell? Congratulations! You're almost done. That is if you can withstand my short range ultrasonic device. Let's test it out, shall we? Heal my eardrums, please! The riddle! Use it to open the safe! Yes. It's so chaotic. <laughs> Come on, go, 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 go. Okay, now it's better for a moment, but it's killing my eardrums as well. It's gonna start again. Whoa! See no evil. Wait, how can I? I'm opening it, please. I'm, I'm fucking doing it. Nah, no, come on. Come on, open it. Oh my god, how does this work? Okay, let me go. Let me go for a second, okay? I don't know how this shit works and it's killing my eardrums as well, okay? Let's, let's, let's... Oh my god, this is so bad. This is fucking bad as hell. This is really cool as sun. Okay, let's get back in. Let my get self one more time murdered. I don't know, why does it work? See no evil. What the hell? See no evil. You no evil. You're almost done. Speak no evil. That is, if you can withstand my short-range ultrasonic device. Let's test it out, shall we? <laughs> Let's kill our eardrums. Use it to open the safe. I'll put a stop to this damn noise. Ah, oh, fuck's sake, it's so hurtful. It's starting again, yay! Speak no evil. It's not that shit. Ah, oh, fuck's sake, how can I use it? Fuck! Fuck! How does it work? I don't know how does it work. No, I don't, I, I, I don't, I don't know, fuck's sake, I'm just using this shit but doesn't want to work, fuck's sake, fuck's sake, I have died like three times, please, okay, let, let me look up a guide, one more, one more, I just need to Batman, real, wait a fucking minute, Batman, Telltale Games, Telltale, Telltale, Season 2, what, there is no episode 6, Hey, yeah, I knew that the episode five is the final one. So, season two, riddle, please. There it is. That shit. Oh, they have sold it in fifteen minutes. Oh, they are fast. Hey, I got a hunch. Come here. Okay. Okay, we are at the end of it. That's good. 
Okay, what did he do? Let me see it. One more, one more moment, guys. One more moment. Yeah, it's starting again. Oh wait, wait. What did he do? Okay. Wait, I don't know why the quiet is so bad. Wait, let's look at it again. Okay. Here no evil. I need to choose here no evil. Why why do I have to choose here no evil fuck's sake? Whatever, whatever. Yay! This is fucking loud. That is, if you can withstand my short-range ultrasonic device. I cannot. Device. Let's test it out, shall we? Shall we? Shall we fuck your eardrums, please? The riddle! Use it to open the safe! It's fucking annoying as fuck. Go! Go! There is the you know, you're there. there it is, there it is. Yeah, pretty... It's just a little bit, yay. Just give me, give me that fucking silence. So much better. E. Ah, oh, thank you so much. Why didn't we do that at Just the first time? Damn. Oh, for the love of God, whatever's in that safe, it'll be worth all this pain. Oh my God. Missile. It's a missile. What does it home in on? Looking at its schematics now. A signal. A radio signal. A signal. That's... That's how he died. How who died? That's how they'll all die. Riddler. Maury sold me missiles for all of my enemies. Everyone on my list gets one. Most won't even know what's coming. For a brief second, their dull existences will light up. I'm closing in on you, Riddler. We escaped your twisted puzzle. It's only a matter of time before I find you. Time is one thing you don't have. I'm trying to get a handle on you, Batman. Partnering with Gordon is one thing. From what I remember of the old days, he's harmless enough. We'll see about that when you're in cuffs. But the Agency, they're a natural enemy to people like you and me. You must be desperate if you're making friends with them. You must be really up against the ropes. To want that government scum in your corner. They're no friends of mine. No, they're not. They'll smile to your face to get what they want. The agency uses people, Batman. Corrupts them, breaks their minds. I wasn't always like this. The agency made me. Oh, this is garbage. Yeah, Waller's a hard ass, sure. But she had nothing to do with why he's so messed up. I didn't say Waller, did I? This goes way before her time, but I don't forget. That's the thing about having a mind like mine. You remember everything. Whatever happened to you, it doesn't let you off the hook. You're still responsible for all the pain you've caused. You think I'm asking for mercy? I was running things in Gotham before you could walk. I just wanted to see if the man who claims he fights for justice is really as good as he believes. But then, you already answered that for me, didn't you? When you offloaded my puzzle on your friend. Why don't you tell Gordon here what happened to Lucius Fox? Watch out, Commissioner. For all his preaching, Batman knows when to sacrifice a pawn to win the game. It was a smart move. Getting out of the way of the blast. Something only a pragmatist would do. 
You shouldn't have said his name, Riddler. I'll make you pay for what happened to Lucius. That must be the guilt talking. After all, the poor man's death is on you. Look at Gordon. He doesn't know what to make of any of it. Trust is hard-earned, yet easily lost, isn't it? Come on now. Don't get your tights in a twist. I knew you weren't sharp enough to do it on purpose. There's no room at the top for schoolboys who are too squeamish to fight in the gutter. You don't have what it takes to be a player in this town. Not without giving up those values you hold so dear. Game on! Okay. Right. This game puts us in a. I'll wait for a while and pass on what we found. Kind of different, kind she of bad situation. She finds out Riddler knows about every agency operative in Gotham. I don't blame her. If they were my cops, no one would be sleeping till we found this Riddler guy. Just keep your eyes open, Jim. In the meantime, I'll stay on Riddler's tail. Hey, hey, hold up a sec. What Riddler said in there about the agency smoke and mirrors, you ask me. But the thing about Lucius Fox and the blast at Wayne Tower? You gotta level with me. You got some connection with that Wayne Tech guy you didn't tell me about? Lucius Fox was an ally of mine. That got him killed. I gotta say... The fact I had to learn about it from Riddler instead of you... It doesn't sit right with me at all. I thought we had some trust, you and I. What do you expect me to do with this? Am I just supposed to sit on my hands? Pretend I never heard any of it? Jim, what you're asking... There's no easy way to talk about it. Yeah, I gathered that much. I mean, I wasn't born yesterday. I know you probably have a network of civilians working for you. You can't do the kinds of things you do without a gigantic support system. And as much as I understand your reluctance to talk, it doesn't make me feel any better about this. Batman. He's like such a pussy, you know, I'm like sorry he... for your loss. Not her. Let's just leave him and go on, you know? I don't think it's still the end of the episode. It's like, you know, looking back at the memories, oh, his sickness has worsened a little bit. Just a little bit. I heard your discussion with Commissioner Gordon. Now he knows that Lucius Fox and the Batman are, were, allies. Gordon's dangerously close to figuring out who you are. If he does find out, I have no idea how he'll react. It's not a chance you can afford to take. He looked me straight in the eye, Alfred. He's been our friend a long time. He deserves to know. I understand that, Bruce, but he's still too close for comfort. I'm sorry. But he is. You were radio silent for so long. Tell me, did you find out how Lucius died? This is a missile I found in Riddler's workshop. The explosion at Wayne Tower. We were thinking about it all wrong. The puzzle wasn't an explosive. It was an emitter. When it was solved, it emitted a signal. You heard it earlier. If allowed to play too long, it becomes a launch signal. Dear God, you did solve the box. We just didn't know it. The Batcave Scrambler blocked the signal. Poor Lucius. Wayne Tower offered no such protections. Our tight little family has gotten smaller because of it. It was the three of us looking out for each other. Now it's two. We still have you. And we still have each other. I won't always be here, Bruce. 
Uh, I'm sorry. Losing Lucius in such gruesome fashion, it puts me in rather a morbid mood. The list of agency operatives from Riddler's workshop. He plans to do the same thing to them. It's a hit list. It's only useful if he has a way to target the agents, though. And I doubt he's sending them all puzzle boxes. Hold on, let's just walk through it. What's happening here? He's hacked their cell phones. He could pinpoint the location of any one of these operatives. And he can broadcast his signal through their phone to make them a target of a missile strike. Can you block it? If I can get a clean copy of the signal, yes. It's the only way I can get a clean version of the signal. It's pretty grim, Alfred. You don't have to watch. I can handle it. I've never been one to shy away from duty, however unpleasant it may be. Of course you can. Let's get this over with. Bruce, get my daughter out of the building. Get yourself out. What are you talking? What did you figure out? I've, I've solved the Riddler's puzzle, Bruce. He knew he was going to die. Ah. Oh. Can you switch to audio only, please? Tell Tiffany that I love her. That I'm sorry I wasn't around more. Lucius! We really made a difference, didn't we? That man? Uh, I, 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 I shouldn't have watched this. I'll, uh, I'll go get that tea. Master Bruce. All right. Now I just need to create a filter to get a clean version of the signal. And then match up the points found in both sound files. Tiffany. Riller. These samples don't sound alike. The two sounds have to be the same. Tower. Bruce. To the Sable. To the Sable. Tiffany. Tiffany. That's a match. Dwayne. Batman. Dwayne. Bruce Batman No, that's not it. Now the sounds have to match for this to work. Dwayne Riddler Enterprises Tower Bruce Bruce Bruce. Bruce! The waveforms match. There. I've piggybacked on the Riddler's cell phone hack. They'll recognize any incoming signal match and shut down, negating the launch. Makes sense for me to have the signal on me as well. What for? Riddler still has functioning missiles. Once he finds out I've blocked his targets, he may decide to launch indiscriminately. But with a signal, I might be able to divert them. 
Tiffany gave me this the day Lucius died. Let's put it to good work. It's not a theory I really want to test. So we had better find Riddler first. There is always Riddler's second in command. Eli Nabel, arrested after his attack on the casino. None of the authorities have gotten anything out of him yet. Oh. Unknown contact. What is it? Who may it be? That John guy from the funeral from Arkham. Who actually sounds like he's keeping his word. Mori, huh? John thinks that Mori can get us Riddler's location. You believe him? Maybe we should go back to the beginning. Bring Rumi Mori up on the back computer. Either of them could potentially lead me to him. The question is, which is more likely to help you? Uh. Mori's a businessman. Given the right incentive, he could be persuaded to talk. He sure can't have any love for Riddler after his attempted murder at the casino. I'd say he'd respond better to a more genteel approach. Peer to peer as Bruce Wayne. However, the agency is watching him. If Waller finds out that Bruce Wayne sought a parley with Mori, she'll not be best pleased. On the other hand, Riddler's lieutenant. Eli Nabel took a go at me in the casino, put up quite a fight. Cracking him will be tougher, more physical. Certainly a job for Batman. He's currently in Waller's custody in a GCPD holding cell. Interrogating Nabel there would be a visible endorsement of Waller's authority. Gordon won't like it. I'm gonna go for Mori. I don't even need to think about it. I'll enable, and and I and uh, I want to Maury. deepen my sure relationship with Gordon. You know. This episode goes for really long, I think. Really, really long. Waller's people are here, watching Mori. Riddler's agency data should make him easy to tag. I need you to keep an eye on him for me. Maybe cause a distraction if I need it. They're following his every move. Gotta be careful here. All this attention must be annoying to a man like Mori. I see them. All of these agents were on Riddler's list. Even without access to their phones, he'll still try to kill them all somehow. Do whatever it takes to find him, Bruce. I never want to see another video like the one with Lucius. No time to waste. Mr. Wayne. To what do we owe this honor? Good evening, Mr. Mori. I've come to talk.
Your visit is unexpected, Mr. Wayne. What can I do for you? A private matter between friends. It's better if Waller's people don't know about this conversation. Amanda Waller is watchful, Mr. Wayne. Watchful and ruthless. I'd advise you not to cross her. The authorities are watching my every move. Apparently, I'm a person of interest. There's really not much I can offer you other than a drink and a seat at the roulette wheel. Not while I'm being shadowed. We need privacy. Lose the agents. Done. They just got an order to sweep the perimeter. Should give you a couple of minutes at least. Impressive, Mr. Wayne. <laughs> we haven't even scratched the surface. What can I do for you? Information. About the Riddler. Why would I do that? You're on his list, Maury. He's gonna hit you with the same weapons you sold him. You and a lot of other people. I dealt with that maniac, it's true. But I was done after the first delivery. Riddler wanted more. Everything he could get his hands on. He even wanted me to hand over one of my biotech companies. I said no. That's why he attacked you. You have no idea how crazy he is. I only wish I had known it sooner. An arms dealer with a sudden bout of conscience. He scared me. I was afraid he'd use my goods in the city. After the explosion at Wayne Enterprises, it turns out I was right. I want you to know, I had no idea the Riddler had marked you as a target. I knew your father, back when he was running Gotham. Our interests often aligned. I would never dishonor his memory. He was a friend. Truly one of a kind. My father was a criminal, Mr. Mori. I didn't follow in his footsteps. And yet yours led you here. To a backroom meet, out of earshot of the authorities. I can help you find the Riddler, Mr. Wayne. I sold him the missile array he's using to pick off his enemies. He won't be very far from it. Everything you need to find him is on that drive. But I need a favor from you first. A favor? Walla has me detained here pending Riddler's trial. She controls all my accounts. I need to get out of the country, and in all haste. You can help with that. Otherwise, I fear my fate is a short, miserable life in a black prison. I'm not here to negotiate, Mori. If you know where the Riddler is, you're going to tell me. Be reasonable, Mr. Wayne. We're businessmen. I can't give you something for nothing. A chartered plane waits for me at the airport. The pilot will fly me to a safe haven in the Caribbean for the right price. All you have to do is authorize a transfer. You don't want me as an enemy, Mr. Wayne. Our agency friends will be back any second. Let's handle this quickly and without disturbance. Everyone gets what they want. No deal. This could have been a lot easier for you, Mori. You should kill me, Wayne, because I won't forget! Bruce, Wallace agents are converging. Hurry up and get out of there. Oh, he's such a beast. Like, Alfred, I've sent you more his information. So Find fucking strong. Fast. When, when, when he's so gentle, polite, and out of a sudden he just bursts out and breaks his neck. Armed men on board. This must be it. Be careful, Bruce. Who knows what the Riddler has up his sleeve? 
Alright. We're getting at, at the end of the first episode, I think. <laughs> this is gonna be some fight skin. I love it. I'm on board, Al. Do you see Riddler? You won't get away with this. What do you think he's going to do? No, he's going to get out. What's your name? Blanket. I hear him. Need to get a better angle. You'll see what's going to happen. My friends will all be here soon. Then you'll see what this is all in aid of. You agent A good spot for cover. I thought you could instead. You and your boss are Walla. Miscalculations. All your idiot colleagues, too. And it's hard to blame individuals for institutional incompetence. The agency has a history of terrible Don't decisions. want him raising an alarm. Your agency I'll has been on my heels far too long. I'll give it to you. You're relentless. I'll admit it's going to feel satisfying to get my revenge on your predecessors. Even if you're really just a small part of my plan. What are you talking about? You brought this on yourselves. All of you. You government clods really thought you were smarter than me. It's clear you're in desperate need of some schooling. My friends will be here soon. I'd keep your mouths shut until then. Hostages first. When they're safe, I can find the missiles. Targeting online. Ready, Bruce. Go, you can't possibly think clunking a few heads is enough to make me roll over. Oversized vermin! It's heating up! S save the beach! Save the beach! Thanks, Batman. Hi! Are you alright? Oh, it's gonna be a fucking little... And he's gonna wake up, I think. Really, he's gonna wake up soon. Really soon. Oh god! Not more. Really, is there? He's gonna wake up. He's wearing something that neutralizes the shock device. I've memorized your playbook, Batman. I know all your shallow tricks. Mori was incapable of learning his lesson. I knew he'd lead you to me eventually. All part of the plan. Is it that? Oh, it is the... The missiles. The missiles. Bait. Just like the hostages were bait. I knew you couldn't bear to let these agents die. <laughs> you care too much about the little people. That makes you weak. I saw how you saved Mori. I saw how angry you got about what happened to Fox. I heard a lot of people doing what I do. My code is how I stay human. <laughs> it's why I'm out here, and you're in there. About to meet your maker. My partners were supposed to be here to see this. I guess I can just show them the bodies. I'm going to ask you three questions. Get them wrong, one of these agents gets torn apart. You won't get away with this. You get them right? This happens! Please stop. I designed this for you, Batman. 
Gotham's champion of justice will die in an unfair puzzle. Let's get started. We have a lot to get through. I'm curious to see how you'll handle it all! Ask your questions, Riddler. Let's get this over with. Oh, good. I was hoping you'd cooperate. But I don't think the agent next to you shares your enthusiasm. You can handle the sonic blasts. But her... I estimate three blasts at most before her insides rupture. This one should be easy, Batman. Close to the heart. I solved a puzzle box for the Bat. Now I'm dead. And I mean dismembered. Closed casket for sure kind of dead. Who am I? Lotus Fox. If you know the answer, please say it. My colleagues will die. Lucius. What was that? I couldn't hear you. Lucius Fox. Very good, Batman. You saved a life. But... Thank you. Batman, don't answer any more of his questions. No, Blake. I won't let you die. Number two. Also, completely self-evident. I am black and blue and bleeding from the ears. Who am I? I think... I think he means me. Say it. Don't you dare answer that! Please, don't let him die! Say it! I need an answer. Or click, click, click! Avesta. The answer is Agent Avesta. You got it, Batman! Ha. Here's your prize! Oh my god! Iman! What have you done? Enough, Riddler. You've made your point. Just one more, Batman. And then it'll all be over. I'll distract him. Just get us out of here. I'm the sharpest mind you'll ever meet. The original genius with Gotham at my feet. Who am I? You're Riddler. Riddler's the genius. Well done, Agent. You answered so quickly, you almost deserve not to get the blast. I'll fire one of the missiles. Use the bad cam to make it target the cage. and use a Riddler's trap to protect Iman and myself from the explosion. I like what you're saying, Agent Avesta, but you're not the one I need to hear it from. Missile armed, ready to fire. Who's the genius, Batman? Who's on top of Gotham now? I want to hear it from you. Question time is over. What are you doing? Clever, don't you? You
Who's the man who's got no time left? The Riddler. Thought you'd get such an easy one right. Those missiles are aimed right at the city. The answer is Batman. <laughs> These riddles are so weak. I mean, everybody can answer it. have to choose between the agent and the, the riddle this can't be happening I hope the guard didn't die. Iman. Batman. Thank God. I, I I didn't think I didn't think we were going to make it. I I thought. You put yourself on the line for your friends. You saved them. Agent, are you okay? My ears! I can't hear! <laughs> well, I don't know. It's, it's better if she's deaf than somebody's dead. No. It's over, Riddler. Look forward to a padded cell. Well, congratulations, Batman. You managed even in my twisted game to keep everyone alive. But at what cost? Agent Investus suffered. So no one had to die. That can't sit well with you. Can it? Must be an uncomfortable feeling. Iman knew the risks. She would have endured anything to bring you down. Sounds like you have good things to say about her. If only she could still hear you. I made you hurt an innocent woman to get to me. <laughs> oh, my comrades would have been impressed. Show them. I thought they'd back me up, even if they didn't agree. They, they left me here to deal with you alone. They, they betrayed me. You need better friends. The term thick as thieves. It's a lie. I need smarter friends. They're all so small-minded. None of them had vision. That white-faced prick set me up. Never told them to meet me here. Oh, I see that. He, he, I. They, they broke the pact. The pact.
Lock the ship down. And radio for more medics. But... Riddler, is he... Oh, God damn it. Oh, this isn't good, Batman. The investigation is a dead end without a breathing suspect. We're in trouble. A lot of trouble. I have no idea how we're getting out of it. I saved lives today, Jim. That's a victory. Now that counts for something, sure. Yeah, but it's not enough to keep the gods at bay. Oh, Waller is gonna come down on us like a thunderbolt. Thunderbolt? I'm the whole goddamn hurricane. Oh my god. I'm about to blow both your asses off the side of this ship. This is a goddamn mess. Agent Avesta is deaf. Riddler is dead. And I don't know exactly how. But I know you tampered with my suspect at the casino. Unless you expect me to believe that Maury's new neck brace is a fashion statement. Batman is clearly being misused as an asset to the GCPD. I'm taking direct control of law enforcement in Gotham, effective immediately. What? Gordon, you're being relieved of your stars. Bumped down to deputy ops. You can't demote me. I just did. Don't like it? Go cry to the governor. Gordon's been fighting the good fight for years. You're delusional if you think you can solve all our problems. You're the ones who are deluded. You're so busy gazing into each other's eyes, you can't see the big picture. Take some vacation days, Gordon. I've got sensitive case details to discuss with Batman. We're still in this together, Batman. This doesn't change a thing. This city is about to find itself in a crisis the likes of which it's never known. Riddler had a crew. Not just any crew. The worst criminal minds from all over the world. Here, in Gotham. Mm, that sounds good. You come across anything about them? I'm assuming you've heard of them by now. Riddler expected his friends to back him up tonight. Guess he wasn't as popular as he thought. That fits a theory we have. Evidence from his workshop suggests he was involved in a feud with another member of the group. Dr. Harleen Quinzel, former psychiatrist at Arkham Asylum. She's very elusive. Keeps her head down. Much more so than that show-off Riddler. He was going to be my way in, once we captured him alive. But now I have you to lean on. A man who lives on both sides of the line. And knows exactly when to cross it. Yes, you and I will be working together very closely. Bruce. All right, all right. He knows who who I who I am. That's not really surprising. All right. I guess we got to the end of this. I feel sorry for her. I feel sorry. I know, but I didn't want to kill any more agents. Begradingly, oh my god, these words.
Alright! Alright everybody, that's gonna be... That's gonna be episode 1. I hope you enjoyed it. I mean, I'm sorry for... For sacrificing every person in the game and... <laughs> Uh, it's kind of loud as fuck, but still, thank you for watching this shit, even even if it's nobody. Still, I will make this video as if someone watches it, you know, like in the like in the future. So yeah, thank you for watching. Whatever, I'm not gonna advertise myself. Do whatever you want here. Express your feelings. I'm just making this video for your entertainment, All right? So that's episode one. See you next time in the next episode.